Okay, so when you're watching Purdue this weekend in the NCAA tournament, I want to give credit to Hoops Vision. They were the first ones that kind of pointed this out or that I've seen it on a video edit breakdown with a voiceover. But they tend to run a rip screen, which is a back screen live play for Zach Eady when he's in the game. So they run a couple different variations of it. The first one's going to be a two guard, which is basically two guards up top. And Zach Eady will be basically at the top of the key. And then you have a guard or your wing forward and the two corners are at the break. So you can see they go little weave and then swing it. And then right here you have a stagger set, stagger twirl. So he basically denies it. So he back cuts. He's going to twirl, come back up towards the wing. When that happens, they're going to rip screen or back screen for Zach Eady. And then they're going to throw a lob right at the rim. Here it is again. So they run a, a little different variation on this one. So it's going to be a two guard and then they're going to go entry into a shuffle screen. So they swing it here. This is a shuffle screen action right here. Zach Eady is then going to reverse it, swing it to the other side. And then they're going right into their stagger twirl. So he basically tight curls it. He's now becoming the rip screener. So the back screen, he's going to twirl up right here to the wing. And once again, they get a back screen lob. Okay, so here they're going to go horns action. So a player at both elbows, rub entry to the slot. And then once again, you can recognize they're going stagger twirl action right here. You can see he curls. He's going to twirl up towards the slot. And then you have a rip screen right here for a lob again. Okay, this next way they run it is going to be a weave to basically a through action to a back screen. So you can see the three guards up top right here. They're going to go into a dribble weave. And then this is where the guard basically goes through number 23. He gets a rip screen right here or a back screen. But that's just setting up for the action they want right here. This is basically a decoy action. He does a really good job, Zach Eady does an excellent job, you'll see on all these clips, of he sets it up well. So he takes a hard step up to draw his primary defender up the lane a little towards the logo right here, the Big Ten. And then he's able to get a piece of Zach Eady's man for a back screen lob. You can see the guard is calling it out. Let's watch it again. Watch the guard's hand. He's making the circular motion. Little, they're going to start with the weave again. Number five now is going to be the one, the player that's going to go through basically to here, then to set up the rip screen. And you can see he once again takes a hard cut towards the Big Ten logo. He doesn't even get a piece of the screener. It's defender. Watch it again. He doesn't get a piece, but he's trying to set it. And then eventually they would go into basically a screen the screener so he would get a down screen. But just this hard cut right here forces his primary defender to step up, which allows for the lob at the rim. This is against Liberty. Same thing. Weave. Here it is. The through. He does a great job right there. Watch it again. Watch how he sells coming up. Almost like he's going to come set a ball screen. And doesn't even really screen and he's open for the lob. This time they're going to swing it on the initial entry right there. And then they're going right into the rip screen right here. Once again, he does a good job. Now watch his hands on this one. So he sells. He sells. He's going uphill. But watch his hand. His right arm is basically going to push the his primary defender slightly. His left hand's able to get over top, and then they can go lob right at the rim. Catch, one dribble, finish. You got a down screen basically into the entry. The guard's going to go through. Once again, you can see the same hand action right here. He's pushing his primary defender up towards the logo. And then the rip screen, easy lob. So when you're watching the NCAA tournament this weekend, you're watching Purdue play, recognize when Zach Eady comes in the game to see if they're setting up a lob or a rip screen lob for him.